these are always popular here at Unique, especially in classics, and this one's a nice one. 2006 Chevrolet SSR. Of course, 2006, this has the good engine, six liter LS2 in it. Automatic with overdrive transmission paired up with that. Of course, power steering, power brakes, AC, AC blows cold, and best of all, clean Carfax, no accidents indicated. Confirmed actual miles right now, 29,484 on the odometer. And obviously some custom touches to this. Take a look at the center grill bar. Of course, the Chevrolet nameplate on the hood, blacked out, the yellow bow tie logo. Nice color combination. Take your time looking through the still pictures. UniqueClassicCars.com. Be able to see the underside, interior, engine bay. Click on the link down below this video in the description if you're seeing it on YouTube. That's going to take you right to our website where you can see the pics. Of course, you can call us too, 507-386-1726. Does have the chrome wheel option on it, as well as the teak in the bed of this vehicle. I'm going to point out some other things uh, along the line as we do this walk around on this beautiful Chevy SSR. All right, as far as the black graphics that you see on it that is vinyl in case it's not to your taste that can be removed obviously I think it's a great color combination interior black buckets power seats both sides heated seats of course leather it does have a nicely installed professionally done pioneer stereo system with a backup camera I'll get into that in just a little bit too Remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with transportation, and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. And as you can see, nothing as far as any major nicks, dings, or scratches down that passenger side. Dual exhaust, this is a great sounding vehicle too with that six liter underneath the hood. Of course, the hard tonneau cover. And I tell you what, when we uh, start it up and I let you hear it run, I'll pop it and show you the bed of this truck too. Uh, there is a carpet mat that is in the back uh, that covers up the teak woodwork back there. Speaking of mats, floor mats. It does have the cloth floor mats as well as some rubber ones that are in it. Still has the factory stereo and then there is the box that the Pioneer stereo came in. Manuals for the truck and the radio are in the center console so those will go along with it go ahead and like our youtube channel if you like kind of modern hot rods like this one or maybe you like old school muscle cars maybe like turn of the century classics you never know what you'll see come through here at uniqueclassiccars.com these vehicles are available to purchase online as well as right off our showroom floor, of course, if you can come see us in person. And as you can see, there's nothing major on the driver's side here either for chips, dings, or scratches. And it does have these protectors back here in front of the fenders that you can barely even really notice are there. But that'll keep down your rock chips and what have you. Obviously running boards, color keyed to match. Of course, power windows, power locks, power mirrors. I mentioned power seats both sides and heated seats. Memory seating as well. Steering wheel controls, driver's information center. There's the rubber floor mats I was talking about, as well as the cloth ones that will go with it. Now you can see this does have Bluetooth capabilities as far as the stereo system goes, so more modern than it would have came with stock. All right, so let's check out miles first of all. Like I said, it should be 29,484. There it is, 29,484. No check engine lights on, service engine soon, anything like that, of course. Stereo system does have the Sirius XM and HD radio, and this is working. Let me get the volume up here. It is a touch screen, which is very nice. mute all right of course your gauge cluster down here battery should be what there's a, a torque pound feet center one 
and then of course the outside temperature other gauges up here that you need are working and of course tachometer top of the dash looks good slip around to the back seat here that's a run and again seating surface what you'd expect with that kind of miles on it nice shape clean Carfax actually a southern vehicle spent the majority of its life in Kansas and Arizona listen to that there's your rumble I'll also show you the retractable hardtop going up and down at the end of this video but first Let's pause it a second, check out that engine bay. All right, underside of the hood. Hood liner, nice and clean. I don't think this thing's been driven in much for inclement weather. Speaking of the hood, I'm going to give you a piece of advice. If you were to purchase this vehicle, or if you have an SSR, or if you're going to have one in the future, this piece right here where it says the Chevrolet on it, uh, this one's blacked out. And uh, the stock ones are kind of a silver finish to it, I guess, if you will, like a machine silver finish. Do not lift and open the hood by that or close the hood by that. It breaks off these tabs. Just take it by the metal on the side when you open and close it. There is an extra one that will go with this, uh, but I did notice a couple of the tabs missing. So they can be glued and fixed, but I'll give you the heads up. Maybe you can save yourself a little heartache when that breaks on you. Alright, here it is. Six liter LS2. Custom touches underneath the hood as well. You gotta remember in 06 there's only a little over 2,800 of these made is all and of course everybody likes them with the six liter in them. A um, little larger engine in the later years than the early models. So definitely the right year to get slingshot yellow. Okay, let me pause this. I'm going to close up the hood and uh, I'm going to show you the top functioning going all the way up and then all the way back. Uh, real quick, let's take a peek at this bed while I'm thinking about it. Now there is a key fob with this and that will pop the hatch from the back. There's also a remote and some cup holders. That remote, obviously, for the Pioneer Stereo. Give you a, a little more advice since we're back here. When you close the bed of these up, you close the lid first and then the tailgate next. Here's that SSR bed mat I was telling you about. And then, as you can see, it does have the teak wood option on it also so this is a nicely equipped SSR nice and clean and tidy okay now I'm gonna pause it button things up and show you this top working There you can see the top going up and since I had it up I thought let's take a peek at it. First of all I want to note tinted glass. Know your local and state laws as far as the percentage of window tint that you can have. That is legal. As far as paint condition looks good. Let's go ahead and slip around to the passenger side here. Tell you what, the dark windows look good on this with the yellow and black combination. Pretty cool. So, retractable hard top, also in good shape. Uh, let me pause this real quick. I'm going to show you it going back down. And then stick around to the very end of this video. We're going to take this truck for a drive, show you how it goes down the road, take you for a virtual ride.
And there you go, so you can see the top function both ways. Remember, clean Carfax, no accidents indicated. Kansas and Arizona vehicle, a little under 30,000, 29,484. Call us, 507 386 1726, uniqueclassiccars.com. Remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with transportation, and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. Hey, did you know that this car qualifies for an extended warranty? It's just like the one you get at your new car dealership, except it covers your classic car instead. It covers all the major components like engine, transmission, drivetrain, and you can get coverage up to 10 years. Repairs aren't cheap. These extended warranties are a no-brainer. Contact us for a quote on this car today. Today we're driving a 2006 Chevrolet SSR. This is, of course, the hardtop convertible that folds down nicely with the push of a button and has a truck bed. Very different vehicles, very unique and fun vehicles. This one in yellow and black. Great rumble to that exhaust. Very nice acceleration. One of the strongest running SSRs I've driven. This is an automatic on the center console, which makes it very easy to drive. We have a touchscreen radio in the dash. Down below, gauges for the battery, torque, and outside temperature appear to be working well. Oil pressure is about 45 right now. That's looking great. All our gauges are working. The odometer showing less than 30,000 miles. And it feels like a nice low mile vehicle. Leather bucket seats, very comfortable. Plenty of headroom in this truck. Brakes are working well. Corners very nicely, it doesn't lean much. I would call this something like a sport truck. Lots of fun to push the throttle down. Nice aggressive exhaust note. This car stays nice and straight when you let go of the wheel. Take a look at all the pictures and all the details of this Chevrolet SSR at UniqueClassicCars.com.